Concerned NBA peeps and tennis fans all around the world, what is up? It's me, John D. Villarreal, the four-time national champion. I want to talk about Roger Federer at Wimbledon. Unbelievable play. This thing, I just got done watching it live. Unbelievable situation. It went to five sets. Roger was down, dude. Roger was down. He was down two sets. And he turned it around. He showed the perseverance. The roof was closed and everything. Benito was looking strong, was rolling. But I think there was something, you know, when that diving situation happened and Benito seemed to kind of ding his wrist and stuff like that, I think that kind of shook him up. Roger took over that third set. It was a quick third set. And then we got into that all important, in my personal opinion, all, first of all, in my personal opinion, only not alleging facts. I can ask personal own fair and tame purpose. Only please check exclaimers. I felt like we got into that all important fourth set there. And it went to the tie break. And it was back and forth. But Roger seemed to have that little bit of advantage and finally was able to close it out. And that was so intense because, you know, Roger hadn't been that great in the whole tiebreaker situation. And that was so big right there. I mean, Benito was so close to knocking Federer out of here. And, and Nadal's already out. And Roger, you know, if he keeps rolling, he has a shot at being number one ranked again in the world, I believe, if I'm remembering correctly. That is so intense, dude. I mean, what hasn't Federer done in the world of tennis? This man is a legend, and he's still going strong at Wimbledon. And then we went to that fifth and final decisive set. And Roger, let it be known, I think that last set was 6-1. He just took it over. Benito seemed to be having some issues there, perhaps potentially with some cramps. Trainer was coming out. And Roger, I feel like, you know, he 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 could sense that he was in control here and just let it, you know, laid the smack down on the tennis situation there. Wow, dude. Huge props to Roger Federer. Tremendous play, tremendous guts. This man, this champion, continues to show different levels of his game. The perseverance, the strength, the you know, I mean, this this, this thing went on for quite a long time. I think the, the, the whole uh, thing was over three hours, I believe. Gutsy play from Roger Federer. What do you think this means now? What do you think this portends for the rest of Wimbledon? Again, Nadal is out. Now you have Federer right there. Djokovic. I mean, a lot of things can happen. How do you think it's going to set up for the next round? Tell me where this goes. I want to know how big of a victory is this for Roger Federer and what's going to happen next. It's time for you to comment. Tell me what's going on. Uh, to me, this is a huge psychological victory for Roger Federer. Okay, yeah, maybe Federer wasn't you know ranked that high, whatever. To be able to come back in the fashion that he did, to be able to show the perseverance, to kind of get over some possible and potential mental hurdles there, I think... Uh, bodes well for Roger Federer, and I think he's he's uh, he's getting into his groove now more than ever. So I like Roger Federer's chances as he moves on. We'll have to see what happens with the rest of this tournament. Very exciting tennis uh, going on over there in England right now. Tell me what you think about this. Give me the comments below. Please subscribe up. I'm John D. Villarreal, the four-time national champion. You're watching Concerned the Media. Please rate this video up. Also, please post your social networking sites. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time.